In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to get Silent Heart in Deep Vulcan. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna give you easy to follow instructions on how to acquire the oath Silent Heart. For you to get this oath, you will need to go over five main requirements. So first, be a tournament list. Next, have 75 weapon mastery. Have 25 strength and 25 points in either charisma or agility. Next, you will have to complete his objective, die to a player that uses an atonement. Chime of conflict does not count, nor does getting gripped in the second layer with a light hook. So these are going to be the following main requirements in any order. So just complete all of them, and once all are met, head over to the beloved Zofia in the Void Sea to talk to the Dread Star. Failing to meet any of the first three will cause the Dread Star to say that you do not have aptitude. And if you haven't died to the Atonement player yet, the Dread Star will say you lack focus on your rage. So, as long as you are able to complete all of them, or you are able to tell which ones you are missing, you will be able to finish all of them in any order, and once this is done, you will be able to earn Oath Silent Heart. You will see the progression of this oath, and this is the description. You're about to reject the worlds, the words of the song, denying yourself of mantras in pursuit of your own path to truth strength, no matter the cost. It's going to give you plus two in posture and plus ten in health. It is one of the 14 obtainable oaths. It sacrifices mantras and atonements as a whole in exchange for the ability to change weapons during battle and a unique set of attacks integrated into your mood set. So, just complete all of those requirements and you will be able to get Silent Heart. I hope I was able to help you on how to get Silent Heart Deep Oaken. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.